YouTube, it's Stephanie here. Uh, this is my Black Personal Malden, and I just wanted to share with you uh, last week and this week's layout. Um, this is Monday today, so uh, it is also the end of my school year. So, sorry, it's the end of my school year, so I've been thinning this out. I've removed a lot of stuff from in here. I've been switching things around and kind of testing out different setups for when I receive my A5, which I ordered uh, last week, Friday. Um, so not the Friday that just passed, but the Friday before. Um, so I'm super excited about that and just getting ready for uh, that to arrive. So when you first open up my file of facts right now, um, nothing's really changed on this side. I have changed what pens I carry around just because... I'm not going to be carrying around my pencil case as much anymore, so I just want to make sure that I'm carrying the the only the utensils that I need. So I have a black pen in here. It's the studio pen from the dollar store pack that I showed you guys before, and the red pen over here, and a Staples pen loop, which I just slide in between business cards here, and that keeps it in place. Um, and I'll talk about my pens in more detail in a second and then I have my pencil here I also have these flags in here this is from the oops and a Sephora um, sample um, I also have these flags uh, so it comes with three arrows two like flags or post-it notes or tabs and then three flags and this is Staples brand. It's specifically made for spiral bound notebooks, but I just cut off the hooks and then it fits in this pocket perfectly. I usually keep change in this zipper pocket, but I don't. I have my change in another coin purse at this time. Anyway, um, this is my monthly view. You guys have all seen this before. Uh, nothing's really changed. And then I have my weekly view. So last week was pretty crazy. I was going through exams and such. So uh, I'm just going to go over how I decorated it. Uh, up here at the top you can see I used this teal blue color uh, washi tape. This is from Desairs. Um, I believe it's a Canadian art store. Uh, they have them in Ontario and I, I'm pretty sure they have them in Quebec. Um, for this week I started to use black pen because before I was color coding my courses but I figured I'm gonna start writing in black pen anyway and it's not that important that I see what colors are which um, during this week because I generally know what I have to do um, so I didn't color code I added a sticker here because I finished three um, exams and the Squidward sticker was here from the beginning of the week He's there because it was the beginning of exams, and he's really sarcastic, so I thought that was perfect. I just have notes <laughs> to myself. I have a to-do sheet here. Um, this is a reminder of some journals I had to finish for an exam. And then a to-do list for a specific exam. Um, then I have over here another Spider-Man sticker because I finished this exam and then a note that I was going to the movies to see this is the end with my friend. Um, then I have a note here that says it was the summer solstice. I have a little piece of washi tape here at the bottom as well. And then um, I've started to write in black again. At the bottom here I have some yellow striped washi tape. This is from Target and uh, this is some really nice tape. I wrote a little quote on it from Nick Walenda. If you guys were able to catch him um, walking across the canyon, the Grand Canyon, on a, what was it? Two inch rope. And it was like a quarter of a mile. It was crazy. Anyway, he was on the rope for like 20 minutes. Insane. So at the end of it, he said, never give up on your dreams. And I thought that it would be appropriate to put it there. Um, so this is this current week. I decorated it very similarly to last week just because I am obsessed with this blue color. At the bottom here, again, I have a Target tape. This is like a polka dot teal. Very nice. Um, I've been using these. I've been cutting 
these strips to use as highlighter strips. I think I got the idea from Mary. If not, it would have been Kent from Oz. And I just keep extras on here. And I keep two of each color and then two extra yellow ones because I use those most. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'm starting to write in black again. So I'll be writing in black on my actually on my actual weekly pages and then checking things off with the red pen um, and that will continue until school starts again in September and by then I will have my new file facts for sure. Um, then I have my school section and if you've seen my videos before this was probably the fattest section of my file facts, probably just over half the size of my diary section and now there is three sheets of paper in here. It's very cut down. These are just some notes for the online course that I'm completing over the summer. These are um, my marks and a little reminder about scholarships. This is my notes section. This is still being refined. I'm definitely going to change it. I have some notes here for myself. This is going to be um, an equivalent to an inbox similar to the GTD system. I'm just uh, refining it to better suit me. Uh, and this will be a different pocket when I move into my A5, of course. I have a cleaning project sheet, a bill sheet. You guys have seen this, my reading list, YouTube ideas, TTC, idea, or TTC token prices. Um, this is my planning for the A5 and then some blank paper. In the back here I have my miscellaneous section which again you guys have all seen so I'll just go through it really quickly. I have some sticky notes here, Sudoku puzzles, and then at the back here um, you guys, if you've seen my videos you know that I had this in the middle of my week and in each slot I would keep whatever daily event or assignment was due or whatever it was on this. Now because it's summer and I won't be writing as much on the actual pages, I don't need that anymore. So I've taken it to the back of the file facts. I will probably take it out altogether or just leave it in as it's not that um, obtrusive, I believe I'm trying to say. Um, and um, I'm getting my A5 anyways. so. Then I have this transparent pocket, which you guys have seen before. It's just housing my sticky notes, hole reinforcers, transparent arrows, to-do lists, and hot, hot task lists, or whatever they're called. Uh, then there's a picture at the back, and I've just decorated this with extra washi that... Um, this washi was on some pages that I threw out recently, or recycled, sorry. And then this piece was from when I was decorating last week. Then in the back I just have some school notes and uh, TTC tokens. So that is my file facts. When I'm at home I don't keep this clipped inside my file facts. I usually leave it on my desk like so. And you can see that my file facts is significantly slimmer. Very slim. This can be totally, there's so much room in here especially because I had it super stuffed in the middle of the semester. It's crazy. Anyway, so um, another reason for this video is because I wanted to announce my uh, new blog that I opened up over the weekend. I knew I wanted to have a blog for a long time and I've been planning it for a while. However, I've been so busy with school that I haven't been able to do it. So. So I got that done over the weekend, and it is now up and running. I have two posts on there already. It is a Tumblr blog, because I know how to use Tumblr. I used to use Blogger or Blogspot, but I feel like it's a lot easier to use Tumblr, and it's a lot better looking. The only downside is that a lot of Filofax users are on Blogger, which, I mean... It kind of sucks that I'm kind of left out. But anyway, definitely check out my blog. It is called uh, Thoughts of a Philo Fly. And um, yeah, my old 
I used to have a blog a couple of years ago when I was working, and uh, it was called Thoughts of a Dragonfly, because there's a song that I really like called Dragonfly. And uh, now I thought that I should call my new, philo uh, my new blog uh, Thoughts of a Philofly. So I hope you guys uh, check that out, and I hope you enjoyed this quick update. And uh, yeah, have a great week, guys, and see you soon. Bye now.